Hello guys, welcome back. So I'm currently 7 and 1 in the weekend league using this team. I actually bought it to play a few games of rivals, right? But turns out that Goretzka and Coleman were pretty good and Zakaria and Klosterman were great at centre backs. I bought a Mavi to try at left back. And I think he's good, but he can feel a bit slow on the ball at times, and I'm not sure why. And Volen at CDM was really immense. He turned into the German Kante this weekend. Honestly, he was pushing guys like Mbappe and Neymar off the ball, so I was quite impressed. He performed a lot better than he did in Rivals for me. But I've been wanting to try out a few new things. Dude, I swear, man. How many pages are there of this guy? Why is buying one player so difficult? Oh? You know what? 31k, I'm, I'm just buying it. I'm too lazy. And I don't have enough time. Alright, so after 10 years of trying to buy the Nea, I finally have my new team. So I know it looks a bit weird right now, but I'll show you what I do in game. I literally play nothing but the 442. So yeah, this is the only formation that matters. So I have Golovin at centre mid, I mean, he already feels like Eden Hazard on the ball and he's great defensively, so I just wanted to see what he could do as the more defensive CDM or centre mid. And Moreno and Lorente, they have to just do the job at fullbacks for one weekend until I get better players. This guy is untradeable by the way, I haven't really used him at all. And Amavi, I'm really interested in trying him out at centre mid. He looks like he could be great there with his 5 star weak foot and his well rounded stats. And Danea, who looks like he has amazing stats. I think he's just so cheap because of the league he's in. So yeah, let's just get into a few foot champs games. Alright, it looks like I'm about to take my first L. In the centre of the park, and the strike pair, Anthony Martial plays together with Kylian Mbappe. Come on, Neymar. Amavi! How could you miss? Amavi! Again! Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Opportunity it is. And a goal. Neymar. Neymar. Yes, he turns for us. Oh, that's a great finish. I mean, it's a nice pass. Oh, please. It's nice. No, Varane! Effective pressure nice, to regain good tackle. Position. Oh, wow. I thought that was going in. I thought that was it. Oh, but Neymar glitched through everyone!
ball and showing fine vision. Walking away, your words are lost on me. It's taking everything not to turn around. Throw it away, see if you'll let go of me when you're not holding me. I can see it now. Hey, when I look. But if I'm gonna lose you Three hours later, we have our seven wins, and I'm dead inside. I'm actually dead inside. As you can see, the man of the match is my main man again, Golovin. He's definitely carried my midfield this weekend. I need to get rid of a Marvi at center mid as soon as possible. He was just terrible. Awa started off great, he was literally bullying every weak opponent, but when you come up against the goal and elite players, right, you realize that Awa actually 
seems to be doing nothing most of the time. Unlike Felix who clutches up. He just didn't really get into good positions as much and when people actually know how to jockey and defend properly, his dribbling just doesn't feel like Neymar's where you can just slip through Varane's and Joe Gomez's. He just isn't so quick to turn in the box like you would hope against the better defenders. Yeah, and Ben Yedder, <laughs> nothing much to say. He scored a few good goals but I mean he's Ben Yedder. It's just that he's a bit too slow to play on the left for me. I, I need someone a bit quicker than him. It's just like when you're counter-attacking and he just gets caught up by the right back way too much for my liking. Neymar was great. He literally carried me. He has the best record I've had on any other player after 27 games. Even Ronaldo on my other account barely had a 1-to-1 goal ratio. Neymar scored two goals almost every game. And he was just, he's just fantastic. He was clutching up, he was scoring goals, he was glitching through centre-backs. I think he's the best card in the game, honestly. Like, if he had, if he was icon and he was central, right, he would probably cost 4 or 5 million. That's how good he is. So, yeah. Amavi is just a weird player. He's, he doesn't feel like he has 83 dribbling. <laughs> he feels so clunky on the ball. He feels slow as well. Yeah, he was just a he was just a tank in midfield. He, he turned like a truck. I mean, tank, in, but not in a good way. Neo was really, really good. I think he's he performed. I so I've used Van Dyke before, right? I wouldn't say he's as good as Veron, but I think he's as good as Virgil. He's just massive in game. He has a huge frame, and he just gets his body across so well. He, I mean, we got better a few times, but I don't think any defense could have saved me in those games. And Volan was honestly great. He was a he was a great CDM for the first few games I played. The first seven wins, and then in the subsequent seven wins, he did a great job at center back as well. I gave him a seven point eight out of ten in my first review. But after that, I think I would say he's a 8.4 or 8.5. I really liked him at CDM. He, he was strong. He was getting his body across. He's fast as well. He's got two goals in about seven games. And Golovin, like, I think <laughs> he's the Russian Kante. He's literally everywhere. He's good at turning out of danger as well. He's always in the right positions when you need him, and he's a great centre mid, honestly. So yeah, for for the next few weeks, right, I don't think I'll be playing the weekend league anymore. It's just too draining to play if you actually need to do other stuff during the day in your weekend. I, I play pretty well for the first few games, but then when... When you get tired and your mind starts going blank, you just start autopiloting. It isn't even fun anymore. It's just a grind and yeah, I didn't really enjoy the last few games. I was coming up against teams with Marquinhos and Mbappe, Neymar in literally every single game. Varane, Kante, Gomez. I'm just so sick of seeing these guys. I might, I might play the game again. I might play this mode again if I ever have a weekend where I'm more free, but yeah, for the next few weeks, I'll just be grinding icon swaps because I really want that Rykart to link with Robin, who I'll be bringing into the team soon.